always travel light and smart. One laptop, one guitar, and one little suitcase. You've got the love priority boarding. Pretty much the first one. So excited to go to Moldova right now. Just arrived in Moldova. About to get on the bus, I can already feel the cold. Tom Halliwell here in Kishinev, Moldova, showing you um, what I travel with and basically every item that I own. This is all the gear that I use. I've got no more guitars, so I've just got the one. Um, I've got no other amplifier, I've got no other pedal board. Us as musicians, we tend to get very uh, carried away with gear and we start to buy like massive effect pedals and uh, like massive micro, you know, stack amps, and then we have a combo and we have a small portable amp. Basically, I think technology is so good these days that you can just minimize everything in your life and you feel way more free. And for some reason that helps me with my creativity. When I can travel the world, experience lots of different things, for some reason I just feel more creative and more free to write songs and things like that. Whereas when I've got loads of clutter, loads of things that I don't use, 10 guitars, I just don't like the feeling. So I just wanted to show you what I travel with. I know that you've probably seen my YouTube channel that I travel a lot. And this year is the year where I'm literally maybe spending two months in the UK, you know, 10 months I'm away. Currently starting the year off in Moldova. Let me go through all the items. So we've got basically this and this. This is just my extension cable with my laptop charger, my phone charger, my Blackstar amplifier power cable and the power cable for my pedal board. Right, now onto the interesting stuff. So we've got this thing, which is a, a tripod for cameras, so I can, you know, film some YouTube videos. Um, we've got my travel size guitar, so it fits in all aeroplane holders. It, um, it's extremely portable, very small. Um, it's the same scale length as a normal guitar. I am looking to upgrade guitars though, uh, because I'm not happy with the tune and it keeps going out of tune. Um, it looks quite rock and roll. We've got this thing, which is my blue mic, what's it's called a snowball mic. And that's basically for my teaching. I teach online. And so I plug the mic in the computer so students can get better quality sound, they can hear me better, things like that. We've got my in-ear monitors. That's for when I teach. Um, I do everything in here because playing the sound out of speaker, you get the echo back, it's just not good, you know. Um, we've got my lovely Blackstar amp, which I done a video on like two years ago. It was like the fly free unboxing when I was in London when I bought it. Um, so check that video out, I'll put a link down below. And then we got my Boss uh, GT1 FX processor. I recommend this a lot. Um, let me know if you want a review on it. I will see what I can do. But yeah, I 100% recommend this. It's got all the effects in it that you need. It's got all, uh, you know, distortion. It's got amp models. It's amazing. And I can plug it directly into my computer and record. Again, uh, as musicians, we seem to be very, or guitarists, shall I say, a very tone purist. You know, you've got those guys who spend thousands and thousands of pounds on massive rigs, and they don't even use all of it. They use like a quarter of it. I'm a big believer that, you know, the tone of course comes from the equipment, but the majority of the tone and creative outlet is in your hands. So no gear is going to make you an amazing player. Sometimes new sounds can help your creativity. Um, but a lot of the times having lots of new sounds just confuses you and just stops you from actually creating. 
And as guitar players, we want to create music, you know, we want to write music, we want to play, perform. Um, so that's another reason why I downsized my life. Okay then, so onto this, which is my laptop, my little, I uh, forgot the name of this laptop, I think it's an 11 inch MacBook Air. So it's a very small laptop that comes with me on the planes. And then we've got my, I've got two cables and I've got this little USB thing that plugs Boss into my computer. And then this is for, this is a hard drive basically to have all my files on here. I've got this little thing, which is a little mood light, um, you know, when I'm in the disco mood. Have I covered everything? That is pretty much it. Oh, one more thing. So this suitcase, everything fits in here. It's a little suitcase that actually fits in the hand luggage. Um, so technically I can take all three bags with me on the plane, but um, if you travel a lot, you know that they don't like it. They usually charge you more. So usually this goes into the, um, what's the word? The baggage send, check-in baggage, yeah? Um, uh, yeah, so it's just like that. Obviously it's empty at the moment, but when I travel, I put, I think I've got two pairs of jeans and three or four tops. One pair of shoes and one leather jacket here, if you can see it. So yeah, that's basically everything about my life. So you've probably seen on previous videos that I've got a Les Paul, I've got a Charvel. Um, well, I've actually sold both of those. Generally, I, I only keep one guitar at a time. Two maximum, you know, I'm thinking of buying an acoustic soon. But anyway, that's basically what I travel. That's how I travel from place to place and still work by teaching and doing other things. And if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. I'll be happy to answer. Mm -hmm.